Welcome to a lesson with Dr. Powell. Let's take a look at how normal Boolean algebraic algebra between ones and zeros, like one and zero is equal to zero, can actually be thought of an Ahasa diagram, or, um, or let's expand this Ahasa diagram and actually make it have the have what it needs to to be a um, host set. Okay, so we have self loops or arrows here. Now, in a Hasse diagram or a post set, rather, you have some operations which sometimes exist, and in this particular case, it they do exist, um, namely the operations of of uh, meet and join. Now, in Boolean algebra, we say and and or, but um, in lattice language or post set language, we think of these as we use the words meet and join, but they pretty much mean the same thing. This this symbol means the thing that's um, less than or equal to both um, both of what we're concerned with. So let's suppose we take one and zero. What is beneath arrow wise both zero and one? Well, zero is of course. Okay, what is beneath one and one? Well, just one, one itself. Um, what's above? both one and zero, and that's the smallest thing that's above one and zero. What's the smallest thing that's above both one and zero? It's one. Just like this is like the biggest thing that's below both zero and one. And we can kind of keep, keep thinking about this. Zero or zero, that's going to be zero. So you can think about it completely in terms of these arrows and meets and joins. You can also think of it as being, um, as being union and intersection, because that's exactly what this is. If we think of this as a power set on one element and we get a nice isomorphism between diagraphs that way, um, if this is the Hasse diagram right here and then we can turn it into the actual diagraph which represents the post set itself with all the arrows included. Thanks for watching.